Now, on a much lighter note, the stars are out in force in the south of France for the 67th Cannes Film Festival, which is very exciting. Mm -hmm. But if you're hoping for a Korean film, you might uh, be waiting a while, maybe another 12 months. Right. This is because none are in competition this year, raising questions about whether Korean films are losing some of their luster. Sun Chang in explains. For the second year in a row, there will be no Korean movie in competition at the Cannes Film Festival. It's a disappointing turn of events as Korea had films competing in almost every other year dating back to 1998. Since Im Gwon Tae won Best Director at Cannes in 2000 for his film Chunhyang, movie directors have used the festival as a springboard onto the international stage, including Park chan Hong Sang-soo, and Im Sang-soo. Some movie critics blame commercialism for the recent drought. Movies that are planned as art films become commercialized when big companies get involved, and I think that may have had an effect. Other critics argue that it's too early to undervalue Korean movies just because of their recent failure to enter the competition. They point to actress Jeon do Yeon being named a jury member at the festival as proof. It is promising that Jeon do Yeon was selected as a panel member for the movie festival, following in the footsteps of directors Shin sang Oh and Lee Chang-dong. It is the equivalent to three or four Korean movies competing at the festival. Korean films weren't completely shut out of this year's festival. Four Korean films, including A Girl at My Door, Target and A Hard Day, have been invited to be screened in a separate non-competition category. It represents a big opportunity for the film's directors. And although Korea is out of the competition this year, local critics are hopeful that next year's festival will be different. This year's version runs through May 25th. Son Jung-in, Arirang News.